It's a battle between two of the CBA's original franchises, Bowling Green at Middle Tennessee. And the Hornets get going early behind this Fred Sertifant jumper out of the corner. Bowling Green up by two. But Middle Tennessee has the answer. It's Torrey Pelham. Comes down and hits the three ball. On the next possession, his teammate Miles Thresh with the triple. And the Storm go up eight to five. Pelham's not finished here with a two-hand jam. Middle Tennessee extends its lead 15 to nine. Bowling Green not going away quietly. Chris Kapushian with the triple. Then his teammate, six foot five inch, 220 pound Marcus Bowens out of Bethel University ties the game up at 15 with another big three pointer. But that's as good as it would get for the Hornets. Marcus Patton and the Storm go on an 8-0 run. Patton with back-to-back three-pointers. Capping off a 17-9 run to end the quarter was this Roy McFadden dunk. Middle Tennessee up 32-24 after the first quarter. In the second quarter, Pelham extends the lead to nine points after that triple. Moments later, Jonathan Williams on the other end for Bowling Green, and this is as close as the Hornets would get down 37-35. Right before halftime, Pelham, who finished with 14 points, helps Bowling Green to a 54-44 lead at the half. The Storm would extend their lead to 24 points in the third quarter. Pelham with another dunk. McFadden finished with 24 points, which was second best behind Miles Thrash's 34 points. Bowling Green's Fred Sturdivant led his team in scoring with 19 points. But the Storm, who were the CBA champions in 2014, come away with the win, 119-90, over Bowling Green to open the season. The Storm's Miles Thrash is currently number three on the CBA's all-time scoring list with 347 points. The Storm outscored Bowling Green 38-23 in the third quarter en route to the route. Up next, Middle Tennessee will travel to take on 1-1 Mississippi on April the 1st. A week later, Bowling Green will travel to Mississippi to take on the Eagles for game number two.